Sydney to London in two hours instead of 22? It sounds impossible, but it could become a reality in less than a decade. Suborbital space travel, which involves travellers being blasted into space before rapidly descending to their destination, could become the future of international travel. But is it safe? One concern about such travel was the possible physical side effects it could have on passengers. But new research from the UK Civil Aviation Authority has shown those taking such flights would not need to be young or super fit, with older people potentially coping with space travel better. Suborbital flights are already available for tourism and scientific research, but they don't come cheap. For instance, seats on Sir Richard Branson's Virgin Galactic will set you back more than $655,000, but regulators believe the prices will eventually come down, opening up such travel for the masses in the future.